This is the chemical application preparation only. Your time allowed is 10 minutes. So you will sanitize your hands. Then you will remove your bag from your kit. Close your kit. Place your bag on your station. Now you will be removing the contents you need to drape your mannequin. So first, make sure your paper towel is laid out for your SMA. Then you'll place your towels on top of that, your cape. Grabbing your clips. And then also grabbing your base cream, comb, now you're going to sanitize your hands before you drape your mannequin. Proper draping is a towel, cape, and towel for the surface. We'll sanitize our hands one more time before we part the hair into four equal quadrants. So the forms are inconsistent and don't always have the same quadrants for each of the chemical services. So make sure that you are listening to your proctor as to what quadrant they want you to do what service in because it might change from these videos. Now you will apply your protective cream around the hairline. We suggest that you dispense the protective cream onto a clean paper towel first, then dip your finger in it, take your finger and apply the protective cream around the hairline. That way you avoid touching the bottle.
Make sure you also cover the top of the ear with protective cream as you're going around the hairline. Now we're going to reseal the protective cream, that way it doesn't spill into the rest of our kit. And then you can place it in your trash. Sanitize your hands. Interlock your fingers and wait for the following directions. So we will be showing all six services in a row, and the disinfection will be at the end of the last service. So the first service we're going to be doing is in the left front quadrant, the relaxer retouch. Make sure that you have an extra paper towel on your station and your gloves as well, um, just to make sure that you do not have to go back into anything as you're doing your service. So you remove the clip from the first section, the left front quadrant. For the relaxer retouch, you're going to be doing 1 8 inch subsections covering two inches of regrowth. Make sure that you are using the paper towel on the opposite quadrant so that you do not get relaxer on the hair that you should not be touching. When you finish the service, make sure you use a paper towel to wipe the mannequin's face to ensure there's no product that has gotten onto it. This goes the same for any of your chemical services. The next service we're going to do is in the front right quadrant. It will be a virgin to darker. In this section, you're going to use quarter inch subsections and coat the hair from roots to end. Make sure that you are using a paper towel as well if you are going to place the hair across the top of the head. My preference, however, is to work from the bottom up. So you can keep your gloves on in between the two services that you're doing, and you'll see mine magically appear right here. 
So the next service is going to be our foil service in the right rear quadrant. We're going to do three foils, weaved pattern, with space in between each foil. So you remove the quadrant from its clip, start somewhere in the middle. You're going to take a 1 8 inch subsection. You should be able to read through the, the weaving and you're going to open your product, place a foil behind the weaving and then apply product onto the foil. Make sure that you're staying very close but not quite to the edge of the foil. And you do want to demonstrate control by locking the foil in place. So fold it one third of the way up and then finish folding the rest of the way up and then closing it on both sides. You're going to remove about another half inch of hair and take an eighth inch section off top and weave that again and repeat this for a total of three foils. Now we're moving into the No Base Virgin Relaxer on the left rear quadrant. To that entire left quadrant, you're going to divide your hair into half inch subsections. Make sure you're applying your, your relaxer a half inch away from the scalp to one inch from the hair ends. All I'm doing now is a paper towel trick because I'm going to take the hair and place it over. I want to make sure no product is on the skin.
This is the bleach retouch service on the left front quadrant. It is very similar to the color retouch service in the way it's applied. We will show you the differences on the screen later on. But for the bleach retouch, you are assuming one inch of regrowth and you are dividing the hair into an eighth of an inch subsection. Those subsections should be see-through. and You wanna make sure you're applying your bleach onto one inch of that new growth. So I'm working from the top down, that way I can flip the hair over onto the paper towel. And make sure both sides are saturated here. So I'm saturating the top of the hair and then when I flip it over, I'm making sure the underneath is saturated as well. So if you're doing this service as a color retouch, you're gonna assume that there's two inches of new growth. So you will be dividing the hair into a quarter inch to a half inch subsections and saturating the, new, the first two inches of hair. Here's a visual reference of the difference between color retouch and bleach retouch. So now we will begin our disinfecting. One thing to know is wrap your brush and paper towel before placing it in your trash. So just to be safe here, I sanitize my hands again because I did touch the trash. And I'm reaching in to get a clean paper towel, so I wanted to show that my hands were clean. Now I'm going to make sure there is no product left on the skin and the hairline. Toss that away. Pulling all the hair down and now it's time to break down. Take my gloves off, I'll sanitize my hands. Spraying underneath everything on your station. Part of your sanitation breakdown is to move your mannequin head to the side because up next you have your nail services. Make sure everything is off your table and then you'll raise your hand to signal your factor you are finished. 